god damn. You are insane. No, I'm like ingress. <laughs> How do you say that in Spanish? I like kangaroos. How do you say what? Well, what does that mean? Yeah, exactly. What does that mean? Well, you just said, how, is that how you say it in Spanish? Like, as if you knew what you were saying. Do you even know what you're saying, Shane? Sometimes I don't. I'm kind of... <laughs> <laughs> is that the fire station? No. <laughs> No, it's not. Where are we going? You tell well, us, you, dude. You, you really don't want to leave. From, uh, <laughs> you fled from the spot. Yeah. You yeah, need to find a new spot. I just don't really like that spot. That one's pretty secure, though. I mean, I want one that's like super secure. Like, uh, take this truck off loading. If, yeah. If you if you want it, we, yeah, we could exactly we could take you to a, a pretty chill little spot. Well, that's fine. I don't know. Actually, I don't know. There's soft sand. Right yeah, there. I don't think his truck will make it. No. Or is it? Wait, no, no, no. We well, can, we I'm sure we could avoid road. soft sands. Yeah, like there's dirt roads. It's mostly clay in this area, so yeah, there's gonna be true. some kind of solid road. Is it like a super long drive? No. No, it's, it's by the old spot. Yeah, it's by the old spot. It's just in the, in the desert. Yeah. We know ways into the desert. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> we, we've seen cars drive through there all the time. Yeah. yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm pretty sure this truck can do it. <laughs> we just have to have be smart. So long. That was a dope spot. Can I ride in the back? <laughs> you want to ride in the back? Yeah, like a hick. <laughs> <laughs> you have very fancy words. Hick? Yeah. That's not a fancy word. Oh, well, I would presume it. Hicks don't even use the word hick. That's how it's not fancy. <laughs> That's how not fancy. <laughs> <laughs> well, when you just they call themselves hillbillies. <laughs> Why do you think hick is a fancy word? <laughs> what the fuck? You know, I'm, you know, I just I hear hick, and I just I'm just like even know. the word hick e is nasty. He hears hick and he thinks of smart people. Mm -hmm. I just presume it to be a fancy John, word. is this an act? Maybe. Do you put on an act for us? Sometimes. I'm just really shallow. Are you almost that doesn't make any sense to anything. <laughs> it makes no sense. <laughs> it was like an improper response to anything we've said. I'm just shallow. <laughs> I'm just being truthful. And that's honestly a lie because you, if you were shallow, you wouldn't fuck a 50 year old. Yeah. <laughs> Mister, I fucked a 50 year old on my dad's I'm garage saying, floor. Wrong with <laughs> this <-year -old>. fucking guy. <laughs> so what was it? Okay, hold on, hold on. I'm kind of, I'm still kind of curious about about your night last night. All right. So you fucked this unnamed, <coughs> this unnamed 50 year old woman. Mm -hmm. You got her really drunk. Like she just got herself really drunk, and you just happened to be there. Yeah, like it just like okay, look. Uh, my neighbor had just gotten a job for the school district, so they were just like... Celebrating. Yeah, celebrating. So I went over there, they had fucking vodka, spiced rum, fucking Jack Daniels and all this shit. And we were just sitting there and we were playing spoons. And like, we were just... <laughs> what is spoons? Yeah, what is spoons? Uh, it's basically the musical chairs version, but in cards form. And so you lay out... <laughs> So say there, uh, say if all four of us were playing, we would lay three spoons out. So when the person takes the cards and passes it to the left, they have to fucking try and make a a, a pair or a, a four a four pair. Oh. So uh, when the person makes a four pair, you grab a spoon, and then the other two players have to fucking watch and then grab a spoon. And then whoever doesn't grab a spoon gets a gets a gets a letter. So gets I, a what? A letter. And are you guys spelling spoons? Yeah. And then what happens when that guy loses? It boils down until there's one person left. But then what happens when that guy loses? Uh, the last person wins. 
So there's no like drinking. Yeah, there's no drinking involved in the game. I thought it was like a drinking game. It's no. just a regular game. This is a regular like, game. Like people play that for fun. Yeah. Like there's no drinking involved. They just play with fucking spoons. Well, no, cards. no, we were getting drunk and playing it. That was that's just what we were doing. It, it was really fun when I was drunk and playing it. But yeah. uh, anyways, you it know. Sounds fun. Uh, and she had her friend over there who she hadn't seen in a long time. I didn't expect that even to even happen, but it just, it really just did, but, uh, so how did it go down, man, like, so, uh, I want the deets, bro, <laughs> so, I, I lost at Spoons, and she went outside and I smoked a cigarette, and, uh, you should have just went straight, we're not going to this one, that thing, I don't want to do that shit, oh, okay, <laughs> and, I don't uh, <laughs> so you lost the spoons and then Yeah, I lost the spoons, went outside, smoked a cigarette, uh, came back in and it was just me, her and her friend. The the, the one that lives there. And uh, I said, Do you wanna smoke? And she said yes, but her other friend didn't want to. So like on our, on our way over there, like, we just started making out. What? <laughs> and I told her, let's just go to my dad's garage. <laughs> 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 and I fucked her on my dad's garage floor. What do you think your dad would have done if he found out? Dude, man. When your dad came in. That was, she was, like, she was being really loud. She was drunk. She was, like, Falling over into shit and stuff. I was just like, God damn. Bro. What if you're like, what if your mom and dad were just in the kitchen window, like looking, and they can hear the sounds like <laughs> clearly, like just clear as day, like just sex groans, <laughs> and um, like your dad just like put his arm around your mom. That dude just totally around that shit. Put just put his arm around your mom, and it was just like, our son is now a man. <laughs> 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 that would be crazy. What if they pointed at, what if they like printed out a birth certificate, like a certificate of your virginity being gone? Wow. And they gave it to you, they framed it, and no. they, they took a, they walked in, took a picture of you and the girl. No. And then when you finally married a girl, they like showed it to her in like a photo album. What? No. That'd be horrible. But it'd be your wife though. Yeah, she doesn't need to see a picture of me with my... Fornicating her for the first time? <laughs> I think that would be really sweet. I don't. I don't. I, I don't. I bet you you get mad pussy with that that gift. <laughs> and then you can take a picture of that. Mad pussy with that gift. Um, I don't. I don't know about that, sir. I, don't, I do not know about that. Man. Are you lying right now? Uh, are you recording me? Yeah. This is just another fucking podcast podcast, <laughs> and you've been recorded this whole time just telling all of our viewers about how you lost your virginity. But I didn't lose my virginity. <laughs> <laughs> I, nice, dude. I, nice. I, I lost my virginity quite a while ago. Now when people ask me, because like, I get asked all the time, now when people <laughs> ask me, I could be like, nah, everybody man. just Everybody just happens to ask you, hey. Has Shane ever been late? That's is, what they say. Has Shane been late? I say, yeah. But then they're just like, what? But now I got a story. No, it's like the best story ever. Yeah. Seen. And before, before like, I would be like, yeah, he used to bang this girl that he worked with, and they fucked by, like, a creek or something. Are you guys <laughs> down to hit Dolores? Please, let's hit Dolores, Sam. What? Oh, I don't know about Dolores. Come right. on, man. Come on, Sam, let's, let's do it. Let's go see Dolores real quick. Let's go see Dolores. <laughs> It'll be a rush, man. It'll pick you up. It'll be a fucking... You'll get so high. I'm going to get so hot. <laughs> just go. Fuck. Just, dumb. just go down La Mesa. <laughs> That's all you got to do. And then you got to turn left, and then you got to turn right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. And then you got to make a slight right, and then you're, you're back on La Mesa. You're just going to make a circle. You're just going to loop around a little street real quick, and you got an escape route, and you're gone. You're gone. You're gone, man. They'll never. They will be like, "What? Is that a ghost?" 
It was like, Mom, the ghost is back. <laughs> <laughs> the fucking Dolores. We got it for Dolores. <laughs> <laughs> for our viewers, uh, for our listeners, actually. Yeah, it's our listeners. Um, Dolores is a house that Shane likes to just scream obscene things at in the middle of the night as we drive by. And uh, it's pretty comical. It might be a little bit comical. It's pretty fucking funny. You're pretty funny. What do you got to say to that? Nothing. I know. Nothing to say to you anymore. I have nothing to say to you either. You had nothing to say Get to out of my life! You want me to get out of your wife? No. Oh, this is my chance. pussy now. Oh, you think you're, you think you're so clever, huh? You think you're so clever. You said I'm on another level? Shovel. Shovel? Shovel. They're gonna bury someone with a shovel. Yes. What? You said you want me to bury my dick in her pussy like a shovel? Oh. <laughs> See, like, that's, that's your fake-ass cough, man. Like, you weren't even smoking anything. You're just sitting here breathing air. <laughs> breathing air. And you're just coughing on air. You're breathing the atmosphere. I just, I just don't understand why you can't just use sound. Because most people just go like... <laughs> You're like... <laughs> it's ridiculous. It is. It's an intervention, man. <laughs> My coughing... Please, Shane. Listen. You have to tell You're me coughing... Go. Just keep going straight. Your coughing is disrupting my night. You keep killing my highs with your fake coughs, and your fake fucking laughs, and I'm just getting sick of it. Alex, do you have anything to say? No. What about you, Sam? Like, we're your friends, though, Shane. We're still your friends. You can be honest. Now, Shane. You can tell us what you feel. What do you feel right now? Who are those hot bitches right there? <laughs> There's four hot girls just walking across right now. Uh, I don't think they were really that hot. I don't think they were really all girls. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm using I'm using hot I'm using hot as an H A W T. That still means hot. Like if I'm, anything, that that more specifically indicates like attractive, <laughs> not temperature. Yeah, hot. That's like howls. Shouty is howls. <laughs> yeah, H-A-W-T. Okay, we get it. Yeah. STFU, bro. <laughs> you know, I, I was a... Shut the fuck up, you. I was a spelling bee champion when I was seven. <laughs> okay, well, spell <laughs> STFU. Yeah, for spelling <laughs> That's so true. I've edited your stories, man. You're talking to your you're talking to your editor right here, man. I know how bad your spelling is. You know, I'm just saying. You know, once... it took me a whole day to rewrite your book. <laughs> you know, what's... I... <laughs> to rewrite. So pretty much, Jeff wrote your book. No, I just uh. I structured the words. It. Yeah, I edited it. <laughs> I was the editor. I didn't write it, I just had to change every Damn. single word in it. <laughs> well, we did have to change some words to make it <laughs> have it make sense. <laughs> but it's still pretty much his. It'd be story. like. like we changed like, none of the storyline or anything. Yeah, it'd be like Freddie was condensationing really hard. And I'm like, what? And it's supposed to concentrate. <laughs> oh, <laughs> condensation. <laughs> <laughs> Concentrating really hard. Concentration. <laughs> <laughs> that was perfect. I was really high a lot of the times. And I was really yeah, I know. <laughs> you don't have to be. Evident. You don't have to be sober to write a fucking book called Vanessa's Snatch. <laughs> <laughs> well, his title was Vanessa's Stinky Snatch. That was his title. <laughs> that was my title. <laughs> It's <laughs> not even attract black people. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, like how your demographic was just strictly <laughs> black people. 
Like, with why? Vanessa's stank snatch. Well, you know, the one that came up with stank. Vanessa's dirty stank snatch, wasn't it? Yeah. Dirty, <laughs> it was dirty stank snatch. Because yeah. I, I put stank in it. Yeah. Stank. <laughs> So you put the stink in it? Yeah, well, no. Okay, he put stank in the title. I just introduced him to the word. Like, oh. I, kept, I kept saying, like, Vanessa stank. Like, she's fucking him up with the, her stank. <laughs> like, <laughs> that's not Dolores. It's premature. <laughs> that was so those two All right, you got to turn on, like, what is it? Blazing Star or something like that? I don't even know where Blazing Star is. keep going straight. Just keep going straight, Sam. <laughs> I was gonna go Hulk, man. Don't do that. You don't like me when I'm irritable. You don't like me when I'm horny. <laughs> you don't like me when I'm horny. Don't make me, don't make me irritable. Alright, <laughs> you're gonna turn left at the stop sign. Stop sign. How come we say sign when it's spelled like sink? Sickin'. Cause English is weird. Alright, turn left, man. Because I swear, e English was just like, you know what, we could spell this S I G. Let's turn it on. There. Nah. <laughs> Let's just put a throw a G in there. Get into the right line. Yes, sir. They could have probably just said S I N E. Yeah, but they were like, let's do a G in. <laughs> sign. <laughs> and I think you turn right. Yeah, turn right. You know? They could have done like the like with a P, this like is psychic. Where fucking AJ used to live. Oh that's yeah, well that's the house we're doing. AJ's house? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> just keep going straight. <laughs> 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 all right, Dolores' house is coming up, man. Just follow this road all the way through, and you'll you'll know when it's her house. That's, that's AJ's house. Yeah, right classic AJ. <laughs> <laughs> Who the fuck is AJ? Well, guy, AJ, guy, he guy, came out, man. Come out? Yes, he did. He came out, and everyone started calling him Gay J. When did he come out? <laughs> yeah, well, I don't know. That was in MySpace days, man. All right, turn right. He was with my ex girlfriend. What yeah, well, he started. Talking? He started banging dudes, man. Okay. <laughs> maybe Melissa. When maybe Melissa him. turned to Michael. Keep going. Keep going, man. Here we go. Here we go. Shut up. I saw you at the Starbucks with that nigga Conrad! <laughs> you should have said nigga. Your cops gonna get cold as a fucking. Your cops gonna get cold. He's saying hate crowns on me. He's saying hate speech. He's spewing hate speech out there. Don't go left. Don't go left. It's a dead end. No, it's not. Well, it's not a dead end, but. That's hilarious. It's really going right. I guess. It's really cool, man. It's like they got to hit the boards. He's not really loud. <laughs> That's how he always does it, man. I feel like they were never that loud. Yes, like, that was like, he was so <laughs> was excited so to fucking loud. do it again. <laughs> that was oh, loud. Loud. He even heard it Sam just go, perfect. Dude, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> he was just like, shut up. Because instantly oh you were just like, oh my god, it got real. Right? <laughs> 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 because it was so loud and I could hear it just like echoing. Echoing. <laughs> <in the building. laughs> Like the whole neighborhood hears it, man. It's not just that house. <laughs> <laughs> That's the beauty. Because it's right on that water. turn, so his voice is bouncing <laughs> every direction, man. <laughs> People on the next street can hear it. It's just bam! <laughs> they were just like, oh fuck, it's back. <laughs> oh shit. Christ. God damn it. <laughs> you know, I just want to praise God. Dude, <laughs> what? I just want to praise Jesus. My Lord and Savior, you know? Fucking Mark uh, 2.16. You know? We are not of this world. <laughs> what are you saying, man? What? <laughs> you just went total, totally <laughs> biblical on this, man. He went total Scientology on us. You know, <laughs> I, I think you're just trying to say things for attention now. Well, you just said in the Bible it said we are not of this earth. No, of this world. Yeah. 
Isn't that what Scientologists believe? So therefore we should not dwell on material things. I feel like you're making shit up, dude. I feel like you're, you're just mixing a lot of like Benjamin Franklin, Buddha, and Jesus all together. And you're just putting it as one. That's a pretty cool mix. Tell me what it sounds like. Benjamin Franklin, Franklin. Buddha, and Jesus. It's like... It's like <laughs> 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 walk yeah, in, walk into Franklin, a bar. Yeah, walk into yeah. a bar. Buddha and Jesus. Because <laughs> he was a philosophizer man. too. Yeah, if anything, it should be Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> but he didn't philosopher. <laughs> it should not be Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> Abraham Lincoln was what it was in the first place. Wasn't he retarded? Oh my god. No! <laughs> Well, I thought like he couldn't read or something. He was just really short, so he had to wear a big hat. He wasn't really short. He was really tall, like yeah, he was fucking really animal. Tall. No, I swear to God, it's the hat. <laughs> it's not the hat, man. I've seen I've seen him take selfies with the hat off. <laughs> I he follow was, him on Instagram. He was the first, he was the first person. Shut ever the fuck up, dude. You follow him? <laughs> <laughs> hey, it was wait wait. Was Da Vinci the one that invented the selfie, dude? <laughs> <laughs> he did, was it first called a selfie portrait? Uh, <laughs> and, like, and they were just like, it's called self, man. You're gone. What a pioneer that motherfucker was, man. Maybe it wasn't Da Vinci, though. Maybe I'm thinking of Michelangelo. Did Da Vinci paint? No, wait, no, I'm thinking different. Well, they didn't have pencils back then. They didn't have pencils. So you didn't they have to paint on, like, scrolls? No, dude, they did, they did finger painting. That, man, he was a little more advanced than that. They weren't in the second grade, come on. Yeah, they weren't living in caves, either. Uh, you know, finger painting was a very hot thing back then. It was a hot commodity. <laughs> they had them at every Michaels. <laughs> we were just selling out. <laughs> Damn it, I was going to turn. Yeah. yeah. It's okay, yay. We can take this right and another right and another right. <laughs> but that one will make a left into the desert. <laughs> <laughs> it would make a left. Shane, your voice is so beautiful. Will you just fuck me? I'm not. I'm not homosexual. That's debatable. Is it? No, I think so. You don't always do the most straight things, Shane. I don't need to do all the straight things. <laughs> maybe it's maybe it's just fun to throw a curve in there once in a while. Would it be a faggot? I don't know. I'm not that I think escape. Maybe I just want to dress up one day. Well then don't use that word, Sam. <laughs> no. <laughs> I hate when people say that shit. <laughs> Hey, I was you have, nothing, you have nothing against them, then don't use that word. Out of respect for the gays. Respect for the girls? Me too. Me too. Piss break. Are you still recording? Yeah. Oh. Oh, it's just, it's a, uh, I'm just going in. Go ahead, just, uh, hey, talk to our listeners, man. So they're, they're all, like, pissing. And of course, Jeff leaves the door open. Can you guys hear those golden flows? Oh. I would rather drip dry. Yeah, I don't want to touch my dick, so I just let it drip dry. Well, that's pretty cool. Let's okay. pull back the force again. Did you guys have a nice good pee? Yeah, yeah. it was good. It feels, it feels amazing to just piss, you know? Okay. Drain the hose. Drain, your drain the main main. I was gonna say I drain your Did you want me to grab that sand? Nope. Don't Squeeze the lizard. <laughs> Did you want me to? <laughs> Who do you think the first person that looked at their dick and thought of calling it a lizard? Uh, I'm not the first one. Yeah. I didn't think of that, man. Yeah, you did. I'm just saying. It's from Bushwhacked. You're from Bushwhacked. 
I'm, I whack your mom's bush. You whack your mom's bush. Like, you're, you're his mom's bikini waxer? Ew, I feel bad No, I whack it with my weed whacker. <laughs> <laughs> my cock. What would you want to do with Shane if you just walked into your house and your mom was there and you just had a weed whacker just trimming your mom's bush? <laughs> 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 and then he got, he got done, and he's just like, good day, ma'am. And he just walked out. Before that, like, it's just like, the bush is so, the bush game is so strong that it broke the wire. And, like, I have to actually, like, hit the weed whacker on the ground, like, and like, bring the wire back out. Yeah. And, like, just no, go, you're doing just the whole thing. Time. You're doing the whole, we got to use the shears for this one. So you're yeah. saying my mom has crab hair? No, what? It's no, just... man, you're giving us way too much information about your mom. <laughs> We're just saying it's like there's a wolverine yeah. in your pants. <laughs> well, you guys are saying, well, you know. There's a beast in there. You know how, you know how when you cut crab grass, like, it makes your, your weed whacker, like, really low, so you have to, like, hit the ground to bring it that's out a smooth, that's what that's I, a smooth. That's what I'm saying, you know, you just didn't get it. <laughs> my, mom, my mom had crab hair. Not crab grass, crab hair. So it, it was like... He got it. It just wasn't funny. Uh, <laughs> well, I thought he was talking about, like, pubic lice. I thought it was good. You I know that they used to sell, um... They used to sell crabs... <laughs> in, um... <laughs> at Walmart. And you would just... You'd buy a fish tank... <laughs> and you would sprinkle your crabs in... <laughs> And you could watch them grow. <laughs> and sea monkey? <laughs> 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 Jeez, man. Are you farting and coughing at the same time? <laughs> That's so exaggerated. <laughs> It's not though. It sounds like it. <laughs> 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 I think you just take way too big of it. <laughs> I think I think you just do it too hard. He just goes <gasps> Yeah. You gotta just do it gentle. Yeah, man, just like, just ease it down your throat. <laughs> All right, America. Elaborate. We just don't like whenever you have a heart attack every time you take a hit. Yeah. yeah. <coughs> oh, my God. You don't stop. <laughs> you don't stop. <laughs> it's like one little after <laughs> You don't. You don't stop, do you? You never stop. <laughs> You just have to make sounds. Cause now you're just sitting there like Like just just don't make a sound for a second. <laughs> See? There's a fucking sound. <laughs> you still <laughs> it, man. <sighs> fucking you know, weird dog. <laughs> <laughs> you <know>, weird dog. <laughs> Hey, and Sam. that's a real cough, guys. Hey, Sam. I'm just, I'm sitting here. And I'm looking. And I see this pole over here, and I see this pole over here. Shut the fuck up. You were talking about this last time, and you can suck on my fucking nuts. I, I really think this one is uh, crooked, but this one looks crooked also. <laughs> Are they both crooked? Did you have fun in uh, Vegas, Jeff? Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> you guys should have been there. I wasn't. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, then I had a great time. <laughs> <laughs> Did you? Yeah, it was pretty fun. What if you were that fucked up? <laughs> you just completely forgot that we were there. And you were like, wait, you guys were there? It'd be funny because I was right by him the whole time. And you we drove. all were. <laughs> and he drove. <laughs> no, bro. And it was so, I, I was just sitting there and I was just 
collecting free drinks the whole time. I didn't. I didn't do shit. I just made myself look like I was playing. <laughs> I really think that they cared. Nah, there's no. so much alcohol in that place that they don't care. They don't give a fuck. That's why I didn't, I, I didn't care. You know, I was just like, just keep keep bringing me free fucking alcohol. I'm they just, were they were on it though. Like sometimes I'll just go in there and I'll play, and they don't card or anything. They're just like, yeah, they just they take the um, shit and we go. They they carded the hell out of me, man. Yeah, me too. I had my shit like. I had to constantly show my shit. Yeah. And then, like, I remember that one time I was standing, or you were playing craps, and you were sitting at the table, and I was standing there watching. Oh, no, you guys were playing roulette. Mm -hmm. And the hit boss comes up, and I just I just see him. I was looking at him, and I could just see his mouth moving. And I just heard him say, like, kid in the Packer shirt. And then, like, not even ten seconds later, the dude was like, hey, kid in the, man in the Packer shirt, can I see your ID? <laughs> just like, oh, man. <laughs> and then he like I showed it to him, and then he was just like, "Can you believe it? This guy with the beard and the kid in the Packer shirt, the same age." <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he did say that shit. <laughs> hey, I was winning big on that table. That roulette, you were fucking up. Yeah, that was fun. This whole this whole won a hundred dollars on the first roulette table that you fucking sat down so at. It took me like twenty minutes, maybe thirty. Everybody there was for you, that's why. Because they saw your birthday and shit, and everybody was just like, oh, yeah. But then, like, then it, the crowd started getting big, and I was just like, oh, I'm going to get out of here, because I started getting an audience. I was like... Yeah, people were just like, damn. They were just like, he was winning, and then people were just like, fuck. See, that's when you just, like, absorb the energy that they're pushing out. And you're fired into luck. No, oh, that's smart. Keep going. Mm -hmm. Be crazy. They would have walked out of there with like five hundred dollars. You pr you probably could have done it right. You probably could have. You were hitting shit like crazy, man. I love I love gambling. Me too. It's a it's a mental thing, and uh, it's 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 really is like a vibe thing. Like if you don't feel it, don't play it. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like dude. Play it. Yeah, dude. Totally. <laughs> That's why I always walk around for a while first. I feel out what's. I just what let calls, myself what go. Pulls yeah, you. exactly. I like how that life game just gave me ten bucks. Yeah. I was cashing out. I was like, all right. Because <laughs> when I sat on that fish game, remember I kept hitting those jackpots on the fish thing. Yeah. I just kept getting a bunch of free spins and free spins and free spins and. I walked from that one, like, I put in, like, I think 10, and I walked away with that one for, what, like, 30. I like, I like the table it's games. not much, but. Because <laughs> you can just sit, you can just sit on pass for, and just chill there. And if someone's rolling for a while, you can just collect some, just, just drinks. That's why I like the three-point ball yeah. You. you just sit, man. Like, crabs. Whoop. That's pretty much what I, I was playing. I come to the craps table pretty quickly. Like, craps table, I feel like, has the it's best poppin'. drink service. There's so many people there. Yeah. And the craps table makes a lot of money. Yeah. Loses a lot, makes a lot. Yeah. It's just a big, big game. But I, I was playing, I wasn't playing like the way you play three point, but like, mm -hmm. I had three points. Yeah. It was just always, there was always a pass, a common, and a field. I always play three point, and then if I have two or more points on, that are numbers on the field, I start playing the field too. There was a couple times I played some hards, and then, uh, yeah. like I, I would spread, sometimes I'd go up to have like 20 bucks out there, like 25 bucks, you know, yeah. I just had like different bets out there chilling. It was, uh, it was exciting, though. Yeah. All I know is next time I'm gonna have a couple hundred dollars to go in there. Yeah, dude, next time, fuck, I'm going in there with like 500. I'm gonna drop 100, too. I'm gonna just drop it and I'm gonna On win. the field? Mm hmm. I'm gonna win. If you do it, I'll do it with you. Okay. We should just, like, get uh, one room for, like, two nights or just one night. That way we can just go up to the cashier. And just give them like 500 bucks and just get 500 bucks in chips. Mm. And then just walk around with chips. Okay. And the tables. Try and just go to the table and throw it out. I like, I like, this I next time we go to Vegas, I'm talking, let's try and win some fucking money. Like, no more fucking bullshit. Like, let's go there and let's fuck it up. I always go there for the full intention to fuck it up. I know. But I'm saying this time, let's walk out of there with thousands. Oh, okay.
Well, we walked out of there with hundreds of thousands. I plan on coming up fast. Millions. I'm, I'm counting on millions. What if you walked out of there? What would you guys do? What would you guys do if you guys uh, won that lottery ticket that's like 25000 or 2500 a week for 25 years? Well, they're, yeah, you just get paid $2,500 every week. So it's like a million a month, basically. A million a month? No. You said 250 or you no, said 25000 2500 2500 Yeah, I was like, Jesus wow. Christ. I'll take the lump sum, please. <laughs> well, I mean, that's not a lot. Like, it's a lot of money, y'all get me wrong. But it's a lot. It's enough money just to, like... <coughs> Really, really comfortable. Yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. A week? That's like you just straight yeah. put money in investments first because it's gonna keep coming. And right now, make I make it come faster. Right now, I make two hundred fifty a week. What about I was make? What if I fucking a hundred times that? Uh, <laughs> two thousand five hundred a week. In two weeks, I have five grand. A month, I have ten thousand dollars a month. I would be like, <laughs> oh, what am I doing with my life? I would fucking, i will fucking do all sorts of shit. Get a job that pays out her twenty thousand a year. Yeah. Or I could just win that scratcher, a lottery ticket, and get it straight up. I would do a bunch of shit. Oh yeah, because you wouldn't have to work. So nope. I'd just be doing a bunch of shit. Yeah. yeah. I'll travel I for get, a long I get what time. Now. I'll travel for a long time. I'll just go. I'll be like, who's coming with me? <laughs> I'm like, it was us, us four, dude. Yeah, I'd just you, be like, you could travel forever on that much money. Yup. And I'll just be like, come on, niggas, let's go travel. Oh, and I'll fuck it. So we would just, we would just, we would just, ch- we would buy, I'll, okay, I would be, I would buy you guys passports if you don't have them already. I'll buy you passports. And then it takes like, what, a couple months to get a passport. Yeah. Save up for those couple of months. And then just be like, we got a shitload of money, niggas, let's travel. Just hit Europe. You can bust Europe like in like a couple weeks, they said. Like, really? Yeah, dude. Like, con- like the countries are like hours apart. Like, oh, that's not. Just bad. depends how you travel, man. Yeah, like, you can bus Take, it. Yeah, it's like there's buses and trains and. You could just drive like one country and go oh, like and go just... like three hours and be in a whole other country. Yeah, over there. I'd say yeah. let's just fucking rent a fucking a fucking Mercedes or something or a van or just just truck around. But... I would still go smart and I'd just get a Prius, dude. Yeah. Fuck it, dude. Even though I have money, car. yeah, dude, even though I have money, yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna blow it on gas. I'm gonna be like, whoop, unless it's a fucking like super, super nice. Well, car. then just get a Tesla. You get a Tesla. And you never Ooh, have to buy gas. yes, dude, you guys are dope. I didn't even think of Tesla. I would, I, I'd, I'd, be, I'd have a fucking Tesla. If I I'd buy it. That That's what I would buy. You know why? Because they look sick as fuck. Blacked out, man. Yeah, they're clean, man. Those things are my fucking. Oh, they're the sick. I just don't know how I feel about 100% electric though. It's I feel like that's a little before it's time because a hundred like electric, hundred percent electric cars aren't around. like ports aren't available. Everywhere. I just can't see smoke yeah, coming out, but it could just be the darkness. Now. But like in Victorville, can you name one spot that you're allowed to charge your car at? BBC. BBC. Yeah. So that'd be my gas station. Yep. I mean, my house would be my gas station too, but yeah. well, if I if need be. Well, I mean. Up to 200 miles on a fully charged one, so you just charge your car from your house. That's 200 why 200 miles ain't that far. Yeah, See, that wouldn't even take me to Vegas. Yeah, it would. No, that would barely. That would get me to, get to, me to that would, like two, Vegas is like 200 and 230 miles away. It's not that far. Yeah, it is. No, because not that far out of here. You see the 187 sign. Yeah, but still, it's it okay. Get very 200 far. miles away. Mm-hmm. 220. Still sticking with that. I don't know. Mm. But yeah, and then yeah, like it's still that you would have to get into Vegas and then immediately find a gas station. Yeah, but that's why you uh. Or immediately find a charge. You gotta support uh-huh. them, like like that's why that's why you get an electric right now. Um, just for like local things, like you won't go that far. But yeah, I'm, I'm spending all all, I'm spending all this money on a Tesla, and I can't even take it to Vegas. You could. you could. I would just go out. You know what? Solution. I'm just moving to Vegas. Peace, bitches. <laughs> Buy a fucking apartment in Vegas. A nice apartment. And I'm just let's like, get a, drive let's it get everywhere. A, let's get a place at the Aria at the top. 
See, it's this crazy. is why we need to design a, a car that, because I, when it's driving real fast, like, a car's driving, there's also a movement that's created, like, you got one motor that's power, powering the tire, right? Mm -hmm. And then, if you attach to that axle another thing that's spinning, and it's just going, and it's, it's conducting electricity, you could have a possibly mm. endless... Not endless because there'll always be more to make it move, mm -hmm. but it would gain something. If you like solar panels on it too, if you guys won a lottery of like three hundred million, what would you do? What's the first thing you would do, Sam? <coughs> I don't know. Three hundred million dollars just got deposited into your bank account. Three hundred mil. I'd yep. just pay off all my bills and credit cards. What if... And then what? What if... We, uh... We sold a design to people where we incorporate solar panels, like he said, ah, fuck. But right into the top of the Tesla, so you can be in the supplies. Because you probably don't gain as much energy through solar panels as the car uses. So you would be using more energy than what the solar panels make? But you're constantly getting energy. So you would have to stop and then just sit there and wait for it to charge. Uh, no, that's the, that's the thing See, with solar. See, it's, it's not about and recharging it. It's just like making the battery last longer. Because yeah. there is extra electricity being generated. It's so still, it's going to make gonna the battery eventually, last Eventually, if you go far enough, yeah, you're still going to. Of course. Yeah. So that's why you create a, a powerful yeah, enough make solar it, panel. You make it efficient so you can go well, further without do, having they, a charge. There would be cars like that if they could do yeah. it. You, you don't think people think of this all the time? And try it? Well, they do, but then they get no, greedy smarter. and they let other corporations buy the patents. And then they just discontinue them. I personally think it's possible. Maybe they just haven't thought of it yet. They've thought of it. Yeah, thought there are people way smarter than us out yeah, there. Yeah, I was thinking, people are the first people that think of this. There's way there's people that have tried this before. Like I'm saying, they probably use those way more power than a solar panel can take. take of course. Well, they're the people that like invent the airplane, and there's us. That's also why we have to put more investment and in keep buying solar panels so the technology can improve, so the industry has money. And then we, Not if they keep getting bought out. I know, but so that's that why would we be the point. buy solar things. But why invest in solar panels? Why not invest in fusion? That's because solar because fusion still takes <coughs> material. It takes but it, so does material like like as like you. It's kind of combusting. Can, fusion, not really. I don't know. Fusion can you use um, something. Yeah, that's true, but. Why don't we just make them run on air? See, that's why I think, like, honestly, like, for transportation and stuff, you need hybrids. Like, you can't, you can't run at all, but there's other, like, like, I just like the idea of everyone being on their own, like, like their houses, you know, having their own, like, power, like, solar and stuff on them. What if we made, just like, this everything, just a whole, efficient whole neighborhood. new car? And it's just, like, water recycling and everything. Like it didn't even have wheels anymore. Couldn't call it a car. It was just not a car. Anymore. It was almost like a wind That's sail, it and it just fucking you could just sail it and control it. <coughs> That's crazy. That'd be insane, dude. It'd be random. <laughs> I don't think it'd be efficient though. But what if it just generated its own air? Mm. Like it made its own wind to push it. But then you could also use the wind if you're going the right way. Mm-hmm. Fuck cars. Fuck roads. Yeah, we need to just make, like... We need to remake the road, dude. Think about how old the road is. When was the last time there's been, like, a whole new thing with roads? Yeah. Like, since the freeway, maybe? Like, what was the last, like, oh, shit! They're trying to... They were thinking about doing that. <laughs> it's just gonna cost a lot of money. The solar power roads? And, yeah, those solar power Yeah, I saw those. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it is smart. That's like some shit like Seattle would get. Yeah. 
because they can afford it because they fucking let weed be legal and they're making a shitload of money. Yeah. Man, but then if everyone legalizes weed, then everyone's making a lot of money and then we're still going to be unhappy because now that the, now we're no That's one no one can no one can hold anything over each other's head. Like Washington could be like, "Ha, well, we made 300 million dollars last year. Fuck you, California." But if we're making 600 million dollars off of and weed, we would cuz we'd be we making would, way more than we'd beat any we're, state we're already with known, weed production. Dude, yeah. Then that now it's not as cool. And now all the states are doing it and now it's not cool to make money and then like inflation happens and now no one's rich anymore. Yeah. <laughs> it sucks ass, dude. And then we got to make a whole new thing. And then uh-huh. we're going to be like, "Oh, uh, enslaved white people. You know what's cooler though is that like even though California wasn't the first, there's still two whole states, and like as time goes, they're just gonna be more and more. California has supporters. to be next like, up, dude. It if, will be, but there's just gonna be more weed supporters in the country, and that's just good for the whole cause. If California doesn't legalize it, like <clears throat> in the next like couple years, like straight like Washington, like fuck you, federal law, like. If they don't do that soon, I'm, I'm fucking moving, dude. Cause that's ridiculous. I don't live in a place like that when there's a place that l- allows it. Right yeah. above you. Yeah, in a cooler place. It's fucking cloudy. It's not fucking hot. There's probably a bunch of hot ass white women there, <laughs> and <Yeah>. fucking <laughs> there's a whole mix. Okay, not even just white, but there's a whole mix of people that aren't fucking grungy. California. Southern California desert. You know what I mean, like. I don't even want to like insult our, the women here because we have a lot of beautiful women here too, but those women are different up there. I want to change a woman. What if they're not, dude? What if they're just the same bitches, the same <laughs> selfie, <laughs> selfie fucking. They all have kids. Yeah, they all have kids. They only date kid, people with kids. The fucking like you got you. Just, I'm still up there like, oh, I'm not dating her. She's a fucking kid. Like fuck, and you're just like fuck. I thought the women were gonna be better. <laughs> nope. Like, yeah, you get paid $15 an hour up there, but rent is $3,000, and you're just like, fuck, it's the same thing, just said differently. Just said differently. That's probably what it's like, though. Well, you just smoke weed. Let's, I'm going to close out this podcast. Uh, the phone's about to die. So, this was just another fucking podcast podcast. This just is, another yeah. fucking podcast podcast. Uh, this is uh, Jeff, Sam, Shane, and Alex. Signing out. Okay, bye. You should play just like the first.